You install this just like drywall. Correct. And you can actually use drywall screws or narrow crown staples to secure it. So it's a little bit faster in certain circumstances. Say there's a, an octagon box for electrical. How would you cut that out with your sonal pen? Question is sort of more, I guess, how would you soundproof that electrical box or any opening for a speaker or for a pot light? Uh, there's a couple of different ways of doing that. So you can create a box before you finish everything with sonal pen up in the cavity. In the case of pot lights, you can actually install most of them a flat panel LEDs now. And you can install the driver in the cavity and either replace the little puck that you cut out of Sonopan or just feed the wire through. So there's a couple of different options there. And then you just cut out the drywall. So the Sonopan maintains that solid barrier. And with octagon boxes, you can buy a soundproofing putty similar to, uh, to Play-Doh almost. So you, you mold it around the box and it adds mass and seals off that box. And you can combine different, uh, different things as well, but it really depends on the situation you're trying to soundproof. Every uh, application is slightly different. And uh, for more extreme applications like rentals, you definitely want to go that extra step. But for single dwelling basements, typically we see sonar pen and half inch drywall and nothing is done for those extra electrical boxes or things like that. And people are very happy. 